Hey, hey everyone. Uh, real quick on the fly uh, message today. You know, I, um, uh, as some of you know, I haven't missed a day uh, in since the first of May and the reading of our little book, the twenty-four hour day book. And, and uh, so here we're we're back. We're 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 live. I'm I'm uh, on my way actually. My to uh, visit with my brother in Campbell River. He's uh, uh, got some uh, medical stuff coming up and I'm gonna go out and, and uh, support and be there. And, and uh, uh, yeah, so it's great. And, and, and what I'm thinking about, what I was thinking, you know, is I, I was like, what am I gonna talk about? Well, community, like family and community. If you, if you don't have family, then adopt one, you know, um, create one. <clears throat> um, I saw a message uh, on on uh, Facebook this morning. Some guy said, "Is my uncle and my aunt have both passed away? I'm finished, you know." And find a new uncle and aunt. I, I mean that. I mean, don't take it so seriously. We are all here to enjoy life and enjoy each other, and, and uh, um, to uh, create a community. Uh, if you don't have a community, create one, and and. Uh, um, and if people fade away, then find new ones. And it's just, you know, it, it's a, we're all kind of sometimes so locked into how things should look. And, and uh, um, we are uh, social creatures. We are social creatures. And I think that, uh, you know, just reach out, include people and, and uh, um, expand your community. And, and uh, reach, you know, how do you do it? Well, have little meetups, you know, like uh, um, I do a thing on Monday evenings. Uh, it's a meditation evening, and, and but it's also a connection evening. Everybody gets to chat a bit and check in and see how, share how they're doing. And, and uh, on Monday night, uh, come and be part of that. It's easy, it's on Zoom. I'll post it. That's a community. It's a, it, it is a little community, it's called our meditation community. I'm also part of, you know, a 12-step community that that uh, I love, and and, uh, and f for me, I also have a a, uh, a men's group, uh, so I'm part of that community. So <laughs> I have it, and and family. So uh, like, uh, you know, I have kids and brothers, and and uh, but we we only have these communities if we pay attention to them and we take time to be with them, and and, and uh, but it's essential. You know, it's essential for, I think, for for contented life, you know, because when we're with people, we get to serve people, we get to, you know, uh, pack all we can into the stream of life, you know, and uh, um, so that's my message today. If, you, if you're spending time alone, it's your choice. It really is. Uh, it, there's so much going on. It's so, we're, it's so, you know. Um, the phone doesn't ring well then pick it up and call people that's that's my message you know build a community share your love <laughs> right share the love okay you guys i'm gonna read this little thing it, today is the uh, 6th of february and uh, um the 6th of february and um this is from the 24-hour day book that was uh Published in 1954, it was written actually as I studied the history of it a little bit in the 40s and early 50s, and finally it was published in 54. It was the very early days of uh, of AA and uh, uh, the 12-step world, and you know they were interesting times, you know. And it was it's a it's another world. Even our language has changed since then, and uh, our understanding of inclusiveness and, and acceptance has changed their communities changed you know we 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 were a different world in the 50s i mean you know 70 years ago we were a much different world so um and it reflects in this book sometimes sometimes as i read it because this is an original copy or one of the early day copies it's been around for a long long time i, I have to edit a bit because it's 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 almost uh, it's you know it's it's dated, that's why I edited a little bit as I go. But here we go. On a dark night, it says, the bright lights of the corner tavern look mighty inviting. Oh. 
Inside, there seems to be warmth and good cheer. But we don't stop to think that if we go in there, we'd probably end up drunk with our money spent and an awful hangover. A long mahogany bar in the tropical moonlight looks like a very gay place, but you should see the place the next morning. The chairs are piled on the tables and the place stinks of stale beer and cigarette stubs. And often we are there too, <laughs> waking up in the bar, trying to cure the shakes by gulping down straight whiskey, hair of the dog. Can I look straight through the night before and see the morning after? You know, most of us, you know, can't. And that's why we need a spiritually based program because, uh, you know, if we could see, you know, the, sometimes people in the 12 step world say, oh, just play the tape, you know, play the tape forward. You can see what's gonna happen. But that's never was enough for me. I, I needed to be lifted out of it uh, by my, the spiritual program. Meditation for the day. God finds, it says, amid the crowd, a few people who follow him, just to be near him, just to dwell in his presence. A longing in the eternal heart may be satisfied by these few people. A longing in the eternal heart may be satisfied, may be satisfied by these few people. I will let God know that I seek him to dwell in his presence, to be near him, not so much for teaching or a message as just for him. It may be that the longing of the human heart to be loved for itself is something caught from the great divine heart. Hmm. Prayer for the day, I pray that I may have a listening ear so that God may speak to me. I pray that I may have a, a waiting heart so that God may come to me. So it's beautiful from the 24-hour day book. And, uh, you know, my message today is short. You know, if you don't have a community, build one. If your family's not local, you know, create one. It, don't take it too seriously. Everybody needs family, you know. And we're hanging out with some people for a little while, and all of a sudden it's family. It becomes family. Hey, Mel. Hey, Mel. Hey, buddy. Uh, I'm on the road, but and uh, just talking about family. Now, Mel and I met. It, Mel's on the line right now. We met in uh, Australia, gosh, 14 or 15 years ago. And, and, uh, and you know, Mel's family. It's just like that. And, and I think we're still family. Yeah, we are family. So it's beautiful. We, family is who you say it is. And, and uh, so if, at this time, you know, if people are complaining about being alone, it's choice. Pick up the phone. You know, we can uh, talk by Zoom. You can go for walks together. There's so much to do and, and uh, to be connected. So love you guys. I'm always available. Monday nights we have our meditation group. Come and be part of that. You know, um, if you're in the Calgary area and you want to be part of our men's group, come, I'll, I'll take you, you know. Uh, so there's just lots of ways to get connected and feel the love. Okay, guys, love you lots. Short message today. Mel, nice to see you. And, uh, yeah. Bye. Love you.